All right, we are opening a box of Battle Bond here at Paper Games. Uh, this set has been uh, really fun so far. We've drafted it four or five times, and uh, it's got a lot of great reprints, and hopefully I pull all of them in foil. So, <laughs> pack number one. Uh, so these packs are super interesting. They are, they're very loose. They're very different than normal Magic packs. Uh, they, they don't feel real, almost. Uh, and the way that they've collated them in the pack is reverse from a normal pack. Usually it's token in the back, and then the land card, and then, and then the rare. But they've done it the opposite way. So you open with the token in these packs. You see the land, and uh, then we flip. So it'll have the foil. And we got a foil and flinching courage. Oh, and a mythic on the first pack. Um, so, yeah, it's pretty good. Box is done, everybody. Go home. Uh, so you go through here, and it's really interesting. For guys like me who like to open a lot of packs, having the rare first is super sweet. Uh, this set also has things called partners um, that they tutor each other out of your deck or can be used as your commanders simultaneously. And if you open one partner in a pack, you get both partners in a pack. And the cool thing is also... If you get a foil partner in a pack, you also get their other foil counterpart as well. All right, so we got a mythic. That's sweet. Uh, luxury sweet. These are the new lands in Battle Bond. They, uh, they come into play untapped if you have two or more uh, opponents, so they're super sweet for commander. Uh, they did all of the friendly pairs of colors for the... Battle Bond lands. All right, and boop. All right, Foil Borderland Marauder. Classic budget burn piece. Uh, War is Told. That's a pretty good reprint for Commander. It's not worth a lot, but it's a it's a great card. It's a mean card. It is a mean card. Mono red taxes. Uh, <laughs> I'm also a child, and I can't open the packs very well. Yeah. I'm just a little baby. Can't do it. So we got Island, Mages of the Candelabra, Swing and a Miss, but Swords of Plowshares. They have a ton of really great reprints at Common, including Swords to Plowshares. There we go. A fan favorite. So we got an emblem for the Planeswalker Twins. And Spellseeker. This is a cool card. It basically reads uh, in Commander, go get Cyclonic Rift and put it into your hand. Pretty good card. card. It is pretty I, good. I would need that emblem. Yeah, I that card R.I.P. Sold him. All right, really so we, we're just a few packs in. We got the sweet Archfiend. Uh, the art on Archfiend is actually done by an artist that lives near here, and he's come to one of our events and signed cards before, so maybe we can get Josh in to do it again someday. Bartlesville, Oklahoma. Uh, Mangara of Corridor. I thought for the first, you know, 10 years that that card was printed that Mangara was a woman. Turns out that, that is a dude. <laughs> Next pack. I just didn't read. I didn't know the lore. He probably even uses his pronoun in his flavor text. Uh, so I got an <laughs> island and a spire garden. Another one of these battle bond lands. They're super sweet. I wish they were fetchable. Uh, I wish they had basic land types, but you can't get everything that you want. All right. Hey, another mythic. See, we got the two partners in the pack together. So when you get two mythics, you get them all at the same time. Uh, these are pretty sweet. Um, the blue one is miles ahead of the red one, but... I mean, what can you do? Some twins are better than other twins. Yeah, I, uh, I know, because I'm a twin, and I'm way better than my sister. Hey, Jessica. Uh, we got a foil auger yeah, spree. I, I had the promo ones. Uh, generous patron, not super exciting here, but in the right deck, you can draw a mega ton of cards. This is a beast and limited. Anytime you want to draw cards. There is no beast um, subtype, but uh, we can all pretend. Oh all right, mirror token, mountain, and newsgraph mob. The worst rare in the set by a country mile. Uh, reprinted from conspiracy. That's fine. 
You get a stinker every now and again. Think of all the fun we could have if I'm drafting this instead of opening the box. <laughs> There we go. There we go. What do we got here? There's a spirit token, an island. Come on. Come on. True name nemesis. Word. Good card, not foil. I would love that card foil. If anyone watching this video has a foil true name nemesis, hook a brother up. Comment. Hit that like and subscribe. Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy. All right. Next pack. Foil true name. Come on, Royal True Name. Ah, uh, Goblin Rays Runners. Dun, also dun, dun. as bad as New Scraft, probably. It's a reprint from uh, Zendikar, maybe? Oh, Rise of Eldrazi, one of those sets that I can't remember. One of those sets in That's that fine, world. that's fine. So we got a zombie token. Uh, mountain, come on, come on, come on. Uh, it was a blue foil. I was real excited for like half a second. And Stolen Strategy. This is a really interesting card. I think we'll see that in a lot of red commanders. Uh, it allows you to exile and play stuff, and any kind of card advantage red can get, boy, it really needs it. All right, next pack. All right, so we're not we're not all the way through this box yet. There's some pretty good cards. True name, Will and uh, his sister, and then oh, Archfiend over there. Uh, warrior, come on, come on, come on, come on, pow! Evil twin. That's a fine card. It's not worth anything, but it's a fine card. Clone Tribal. Mimeoplasm likes that card. All right. Forest and something. Plus one, plus one counters. Tap some stuff down. Pretty good and limited. Pretty bad out of a pack. That's all right. There we go. Let's see what this pack brings. Sower of Temptation. Great card. If you like Pretty stealing people's creatures, I love stealing people's creatures. I love stealing all the creatures all the time, 100%. All right, so what do we have next? Swamp and Corvath the Bright Flame. So this is Dragons and Knight Tribal. Uh, they each kind of buff each other. All right, so next pack. All right, this is officially we're halfway through the box. Um, I'm pretty happy so far. We got room for a doubling season, maybe. Haven't seen a foil rare yet. I've seen a lot of these boxes have two foil rares, so let's let's hope and pray. So there's a zombie and tight spout tyrant. That's fine. It's a fine card. Uh, in the right decks, it's really really brutal. Commanders. It says for each card exiled this way. Uh, look it up. I don't know off the top of my head. All right, Warrior Plains and Apocalypse Hydra. A lot of green red commander decks really like that card. It's fun. And with plus one, plus one counters, it's really good. There's lots of plus one, plus one counter synergy in the set. Like if we were playing Battle Bond, this is a Mega Bomb. It's a 10 cent Mega Bomb. Let's, <laughs> way and to go, turns out, And it turns out it has the power to end games unlimited. Hey, Land Tax. All right, $17. It's a pretty good reprint. It was creeping up to 40 Lord knows what the original print is at. Probably 60 80 $100 million. That's fine. Land Tax is a fine card. All right, Zombie, Island, and Sentinel Tower. This went directly into my Mizzix Spell Slinger deck. Does a ton of damage. Uh, like it lots. Super thumbs up for that card. Yeah, it turns out it's busted in the instant and sorcery style decks. All right. All right, another one of the battle bomb lands. Pretty good. Not gonna say, not gonna say no to that. Next pack. What's the original land tax, Jeremiah? From Legends. See a cloud. The second scent of magic. All right. So we have lots of the Battle Bond lands. I'm happy about it. That's fine. Those are good cards. Angelic Chorus. This is a reprint from Urza Saga. I think it was also in 10th edition. But uh, when I was a wee lad, I went to an Urza Saga pre-release, and this is one of my rares that I had way, way back when, when it had angels all over the art. Won me a couple of games. Felt good about that. Little me was very happy to have Angelic Chorus. Uh, next pack. All right, Zombie Giant, cool, we did it. And a mountain, come on, foil, what's your name? Uh, foil, foil Canopy something. Spider, that's fine. 
Uh, I got a canopy spider. I can go home happy. Everything is awesome. Uh, Together Forever is another one of those support cards. Um, it, it has some utility. I don't know if it'll ever see a lot of play, but someone might love that card. Someone might open it and love it. So, can't trash talk it. Someone might love it. Alright, Warrior Island. Uh, game plan. So this is Time Twister with Assist. Um, it doesn't... Uh, yeah, it exiles itself just like Time Twister. So, or unlike Time Twister, I mean. So not as great, but it doesn't cost $2,000, so we can all be happy to put it in our commander decks. Here we go. Vigor! Oh boy, that guy is real good. Uh, there's a, So like I said, there's a ton of plus one, plus one counters in this set. Um, and it comes in a pack with Plated Crusher, which will be super sweet and sealed. Plated Crusher will win you every game you play it in sealed. It is like a mythic uncommon. Super duper good. Uh, next pack, if I can open it sometime this year. There we go. Teamwork. Little baby. Little baby, little baby hands. Can't do it. All right, so zombie token. That's fine. Lots of tokens. Mountain, come on. Foil true name. Nixithid. Uh, I used to play that in a janky modern hand hate deck, a discard deck that had dot seizes and, and all kinds of really dumb discard cards. Inquisition is a Coslet. For a minute, it crept up there. I had some foils, and it was nice. Someone wanted them, gave them a good home. Got a warrior, an island, uh -huh, and a bramble sovereign. So this is sweet also in token decks. It's sort of like uh, Doubling Season's Kid Brother, uh, which is fine. And okay, next pack. All right, we only got a few packs left. So so let's hope we get a foil Doubling Season. Battle Bond Land, not bad, not bad. I really need a foil, a foil true name for my power cube. That would be the bee's knees. Uh, zombie Giant, we got a Swamp. Ah, oh, Foil Land Tax! Hey, baby! We did it, everybody. We did it. All right, Foil Land Tax. Uh, oh, it's so shiny. Mm, it's so pretty. I love it. Great card. <laughs> Good card. Happy to have it. Foil Mythic. Rock on. All right. How much do those go for? I don't know. That's probably like $30, $40. Who knows? The Judge Foil is $105, so I might be way off. Uh, and this does have the same art as the Judge Foil. They didn't use the original art, which I'm grateful for because that's super pretty art. With the land coming out of the chest there. All right. All right, what do we got now? Ah, bonus round. That's pretty cool. That's a Spell Slinger deck that also went into Mizzix. I would love to take 14 extra turns. Thank you very much. Next pack. All right. Man, I sure got a bottle of water. I didn't think I'd love these cards this much. I keep talking. All right, Zombie, Planes, and Seedborn Muse. All right. That card had crept up to like $30. I think the reprints put it at about 6 or 7 Still, very, very good card. Uh, happy to play it in any green deck I have. Uh, happy to play it in a Planeswalker deck, that's for sure. And Diabolic Intent. That's another great reprint. All right, we got two packs left. So let's... Take a look. Pop, pop. Uh, foil something. And Thrilling Encore. This is really cool. So it puts all creatures that died this turn onto the battlefield um, at instant speed. So if someone rafts and there's a giant and there's a giant board full of everything, cool, you get a thousand creatures. Literal thousand. You can quote me on it. Very cool card. I think it becomes a black commander staple. Uh, I'm going to start playing it in just about everything. I really, really enjoy it. All right, we got the emblem for the sister. And this is our last rare, so I'm going to slow roll it. It's white. It's a foil battle mastery. All right, we still got tension. We still got tension. Ah, uh, it's Peer and Toothy. These guys are super sweet. He's kind of like a doubling season on a stick, and that guy is a better chasm skulker. Uh, thank you guys for watching tonight. Um, this has been Battle Bond. And... Uh, yeah, have a good night. See ya. <laughs> Smash that subscribe button. Smash that subscribe button. Approach doing